Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to talk about super exciting AI powered video creating using Tora and how it works in Comfy UI. I'll show you how to create text videos where you control the motion. We will do this by using Tora's trajectory oriented diffusion transformer. So let's get started. Okay, so before we jump into making videos, let's quickly cover what Tora is and why it's awesome. Tora is an AI model that helps you create videos. But the really cool part, you can control how things move in your video by drawing paths or motion trajectories. It's like giving your video objects a map to follow, like a balloon floating up, a dog walking, all smoothly following the, in their paths. So for an example, imagine you want a car to zoom along a track or a butterfly to fly in a graceful pattern. With Tora, you can tell your video exactly how you want things to move. So Tora can make videos up to 720 pixels with 204 frames, giving you short and long videos that look great, pretty neat. So let's get started how to set it up in Comfy UI. But before we continue, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Your support motivates us to keep delivering unique and valuable content. Coming back to setting up Comfy UI. Open your Comfy UI, load the workflow. All the workflow links you can download from our website comfyuiblog.com. After watching this video, you became a master in creating text to video generation. Know how to use this graph in video generation. Just watch till the end. You can watch the previous content on my channel on Cov Video 5G model to create text to video and learn how to optimize and, and how to run this on low VRAM also. And what other settings will be best for generating this model. Now the workflow has been opened and let's start working on this node. Download Cov Video model. Here, select the model Cov Video X5B Tora. In precision, you have to select BF16. Here, if you have 12 GB VRAM or less than this, then select BF16 and make sure FPA transformer is enabled and you can select the compile as one diff. If you want to increase the speed for generating the videos. On the other side, if you want to have better quality result and you have VRAM of 24 GB, you can go for FP32 for precision and FPA transfer is disabled. But model and compile will be same as per last settings. Coming to download Tora. Coming to download Tora model, it will automatically select COG Video 5B Tora model. Let me tell you. Once you will queue prompt your model, it will automatically download your Tora model and save it in your Comfy UI model folder. So you don't need to put any extra efforts. Next, in load clip, we have selected Google T5 XXL FP8 model, which is for text encoding. Now coming to Coke Video Sampler. We will use 32 steps as for the settings CFG6 and scheduler COG video XTPM scheduler for best results. Next, coming to spline editor, which is the most important setting in this workflow. And by this spline editor, we will create path which will give motion to the video. Now moving forward, let's come to main part, spline editor, which is the most important setting in this workflow. And by the spline editor, we will create path which will give motion to the video as I had given in Tora. For the settings, mask width will be 720 pixels, height 480 pixels, points to sample is 49 frame. Uh, you can go up to 204 frames for longer videos. Sampling method will be path to create the 
roadmap. Rest of the settings you can see here in this video and it will be default. Here you can see this graph. If the arrows are going towards right, then the motion will be towards left and vice versa. Okay. And same goes with upward and downward situation. The motion will be opposite side of the arrows. Just an add-on. If you want to invert the arrows, just click right and click on invert point order. And to add an extra arrow, just press ctrl and click. And you can remove this arrow by clicking the right. And you can move the path as per your choice. Anywhere, whether you want to make a circle or square, whatever. And there is one more point. And there is one more important setting, which is interpolation. There are few selected paths in interpolation, which will give your path a straight line. You can choose according to your need as we are going for cardinal. For more detailed content about this line editor, please wait for next part, which will be image to video generation. Now everything is in place in setting. Now let's start. Everything is in place in settings. Now let's start text to video generation. Here, as you can see, I have given this text prompt about a sail sailboat moving in a mist covered river in a green forest and with some other extra details. You can check here in this prompt. And in spline editor, I have made this straight path which is going towards right. So now the video has been generated. You can see the mist green forest and a moving boat. It is as per the text prompt exactly. And the video quality is looking good also. Aside. Here I had given the path, the straight path towards right, but in the result, it is moving towards left. As we had discussed earlier, it will go vice versa. Now we will go vice versa and we'll generate a new video with same text prompt. And in the result, the boat is moving towards the right. In another example, with same text prompt, I have changed the arrow and made a little bit curve towards upside. And in the result, you can see boat is moving downside with a bit curve. So this is how you can use Tora in Confi UI. So that's all for the today's video. And if you enjoyed this tutorial, share this video more and more. And don't forget to subscribe for more cool AI tutorials. And if you create something cool with Tora, drop a link in the comments. I would like to see what you make. Until next time, keep creating and have fun.